Welcome back to the channel everyone. Today we will be unboxing the Synco G2A2 wireless microphone. Remember to like, subscribe and share if you like this video. The Synco G2A2 is a single receiver with two wireless microphones. Some of the key features are 492 feet or 150 meters line of sight transmission, a TFT screen with mono or stereo output. This comes with just about everything you could want in a single package to start recording your audio and video. Upon opening the box you get a hard shell carry bag and the instructions. Opening the hard shell carry bag you have the single receiver and two transmitters along with all of the other components. There are two external lavalier mics, one 3.5mm phone cable, one 3-in-1 charger, one 3.5mm TRS camera cable, two wind muffs for the lavalier mics, two windshields for the transmitters, two clips for the lavalier mics. Looking at the receiver it's pretty small measuring in at around 2 inches by 1 5 of an inch. On top we have a microphone out jack. If you have someone recording you, they can hear the live output of the microphone. On the left hand side there is a USB-C charging connector along with on off mono stereo button. There's nothing on the bottom. On the right hand side there are the channel A and B gain controls along with a hard reset pinhole. On the back there is a clip to securely attach this. It will also fit onto a camera hot shoe gun. For the transmitter, this is pretty much the same size. Now on top, we have the built-in microphone with the option to add the windshield as needed. On the right hand side, there is the low cut button. This will not record anything under the 150Hz range when selected. There is also the pairing button if needed. These are already paired straight out of the box. Lastly, on the right hand side, is the hard reset pinhole just like the receiver. On the left hand side we have the mute button, USB-C charging connector and the external lavalier microphone input jack. On the back we have a similar clip as the receiver which you can attach to t-shirts, belts, hats etc. Use the mono stereo button on the receiver to power this on. It needs to be held in for about 3 seconds. For the transmitter you will need to press the mute button for about 3 seconds. These will immediately start picking up sound and you'll see the sound indicators on the TFT screen start moving around. There is also a battery indicator along with the connectivity link on the transmitters. To power the transmitters and receivers off, hold down the same button for powering on for about 3 seconds. The kit comes with a 3-in-1 USB-C charging cable. This is convenient so you don't need to carry two or three cables everywhere you go. The other end of the cable is a USB type B connector. These all plug in like any other USB-C cables and connectors do for other devices. Next up are the lavalier mics. You get two of these in the kit. Each has its own wind muff and clips. These are pretty easy to assemble. The wind muff slide over the microphone, I'm turning it to ensure that the wind muff covers all of the microphone and the clip attaches to the bottom of the microphone. These will then plug into each of the transmitters. Each of the transmitters comes with a windshield for the built-in microphone. There are two small connectors on the windshield that slot into the holes either side of the microphone. The Synco G2A2 comes with two output cables, a 3.5mm TRS cable for cameras and a 3.5mm TRRS cable for mobile phones. You can also plug in almost any headphones into 3.5mm jack to hear the live signal. Now that everything has been unboxed, let's see if we can get all the cables the transmitter and receiver back into the hard case. The two transmitters and receivers have their own dedicated spots with loosely fitting cutouts at the bottom of the carry case. The TRS cable, the TRRS cable, 3-in-1 charging cable, lovely microphone with clip and wind muff attached, lovely microphone 2 with clip and wind muff attached, 
windshield for the inbuilt microphone and transmitters, and second windshield for the second transmitter. That's everything in the carry case. This closes pretty easily, no need trying to squeeze everything down and pushing bits of cable or parts of the windshield to zip it up. The voiceover for this video was recorded with the Synco G2A2. Let me know what you think of the sound quality for the video. Remember to like, subscribe, comment and share. Have a great day everyone. Check back for more unboxing, reviews and anything else we can think of to post.